Hey guys, All In Crypto here and welcome to another video. So guys, the video that I have for you guys today is uh, going to be about Tezos and um, essentially I wasn't going to make this video um, but I can see Tezos kind of gaining momentum and I think, in fact, I'm sure um, that Tezos is going to break out soon um, and the reason that I think this is because not only is Tezos a fantastic project, but just how closely it's been following Chainlink. Tezos and Chainlink have really been linked together. They've moved together. Um, Tezos is 12th in the market cap, if we take a look here. Um, Chainlink is 6th. That uh, Usually they were kind of moving together. They've been very much linked together until recently, where Chainlink's had a fantastic run. It's a doubt. We are having a bit of a pullback in the market today. I don't expect this to last too long. Um Pullbacks, believe it or not, aren't necessarily a bad thing. A lot of the times it's just people taking profits um, or, you know, maybe there's a bit of speculation on some bad news. Who, who knows? Um, you know, there could be a million and one reasons why we're having a pullback. Pullbacks aren't, like I say, necessarily a bad thing. Pullbacks can often um, kind of preempt a, a, a move. Now, I'm not saying we're going to have a huge move recently, but what I am here to, do, to, to tell you guys about today is that Tezos is a coin you don't want to miss out on. I've been accumulating Tezos for around about a year, year and a couple months now. Uh, my average bid on Tezos is about $1.30 to $1.60, round about that area. So I, I, I am massively in the green on Tezos. Tezos has been fantastic for me. Um, I bought Tezos and, and Link, Chainlink at the same time. Um, so, guys, let me try and show you guys uh, what I'm kind of expecting Tezos to do. It's disappointed me uh, a little bit uh, because Link, the way Link's kind of moved, but they're, they're different things. Tezos is um, its own blockchain. It's built from the ground up. It was an ICO in 2017. Now, a lot of ICOs aren't here today. Tezos has withstood the test of time. I think the ICO it went for around about 40 cents. Um, Tezos is still here today, and I believe that Tezos is a fantastic project. One reason I believe that is because you can actually um, earn investment. You can earn, uh, not investment, sorry, interest on your money that you have in Tezos through something called baking. Baking tends to be sort of, four to six percent annually you can bake on a number of different networks you don't need a, a set amount of coins uh, as long as you have in, uh, some coins a lot of places will let you contribute those coins to baking so guys let me try and show you why i believe tezos has something big coming and yeah let's get on with the video so tezos uh, this not a lot of charts really show the full price history of tezos so unfortunately, I'm going to have to use this small Coinbase one. This chart, of course, is a macro chart. You can see really that we've broken out. Um, we've broken out of this sort of downwards trend. Um, and the same way that many of the other coins in the, in the crypto space have done, we are now, in my opinion, we're in a, we're in a bull market. Um, we've, we, we've really just started the bull market. You know, we've bottomed out and we are now sort of, Going, going higher. Uh, so, like I say, Chainlink and Tezos have followed each other very well. So what I've got here for you is a chart in US dollars. The reason I'm using US dollars, uh, and it's really just in percentages more than anything, is because US dollars are the most widely kind of accepted currency. Um, but if we take a look at just how closely uh, Chainlink and Tezos are following each other, I mean, it's very, very similar. Tezos is, is the uh, blue um, chain link is the red now guys if we take a look at this in my opinion we're here maybe here you know we, we've got this impulsive move to come um, I, I Tezos like I say is a great project I, I didn't really plan on making this video the reason I've decided to make this video is because I'm going away for a couple of days so I thought I'd get this out um, you guys don't want to miss out on Tezos like I say do your own research before you put any money into it. Don't just take my uh, word for it. Tezos is fantastic. It's an excellent, excellent project. It's a smart contract uh, project uh, in, similar to Ethereum, similar to uh, EOS, similar to quite a few other things, but it's unique. Um, it's, it's governed more so by the uh, kind of participate, participants in the network um, and, and how it's kind of governed is really based on your stake if you have a lot it, it, it's a proof of it, it, it's a proof of stake coin whereas bitcoin or something like that is proof of work where you use your computing power in tezos you need to have the tezos 
to kind of have a, have a say. Um, so I'm, I don't want to go too much into the technicals of Tezos because I'm going to make a whole separate video about Tezos. But guys, I really just wanted to share with you this quickly, um, sort of what's going on in Tezos, where I can see it going. Guys, these charts look so similar. Um, and Tezos really has kind of underperformed Chainlink. I think there's a, a number of reasons uh, why that is. I think Chainlink is fantastic. I'm going to do a, a super long video on, on Chainlink, but I thought this was important for me to just get this video out. Um, because look, I mean, it's, it's so similar. Um, and, you know, market cap still extremely small. Um, so guys, you know, I hope that this has made some sense. Uh, before I wrap things up, Tim Draper, who is a venture capitalist, um, a successful venture capitalist, quite a well-known guy. It, it's no secret that he is um, heavily into Tezos and as an investor in Tezos. And, you know, a lot of investing really is following the smart money, so to speak, the money that knows what it's doing. There are a lot of people backing Tezos. With, Tezos has a lot of promise. And like I say, the way that it's following Chainlink is, you know, they were neck and neck. I'm pretty sure Chainlink was at 11th in market cap not that long ago until it's kind of had its rally. Um, and you can kind of see that they were neck and neck as far as they were moving together. Chainlink's really broken out. Tezos kind of got left behind. But I think that's to come with Tezos. My price, uh, I'm not going to give you my exact price prediction, but... I'll give you roughly where I think Tezos will end up. I think Tezos is a hundred dollar coin. I think it's a hundred dollar coin. Let, I mean, let that sink in. A hundred dollars. Today you're at roughly four dollars and thirteen cents. Um, I think I think the, the the only way is up from here, guys. So this is just a short video. I want to wrap this up um, and just kind of say, guys, keep your eyes on Tezos. I think Tezos is going to be fantastic. Look, it's in the green. Um, when everything else in the red, I hope it breaks out soon. I'm expecting it to break out soon. And yeah, guys, uh, thank you very much for watching.